So, did y'all know Christina Ricci's daddy was a failed cult leader? <laughs> if you guys are new here, my name is Ashley and this is My Sweet Perspective, where I give my take on all things TV and movie related. And y'all know that I'm here to put you on and I'm back to talk about the Child Star documentary that aired yesterday um, with Demi Lovato making her directorial debut with this. And it was really all about her life, um, honestly. And some of the other child stars that you know we all have known and loved and while i think she makes an attempt um to tell the truth and i believe that truths are told this was not hard hitting um and really didn't go deep beneath the surface right which is what i felt like i wanted from this i almost feel like we needed um a cautionary tale you know what i mean um also, the fact that even with the other interviews that she had, because we had Keenan with his sunglasses on there, uh, we had, of course, Demi Lovato, Drew Barrymore, Christina Ricci, Raven, um, Allison. We, we had a ton of child stars there. It felt really like even in the conversations, even in the discussions, the dialogue, um, it really all came back to Demi and her situation. And I think if we're going to talk about child stars, each needed a way and a platform to express their own story fully. Um, now on TikTok, they told me, you know, well, it wasn't going to be hard hitting. If it had been, people probably wouldn't have signed up to come, at, come on. Um, but I think we're in the age of telling the truth, right? And so I think when you come off the heels of something like Quiet on Set, um, the expectation is, is that you're going to tell the complete truth because we know that there was more that happened. You know what I mean? Um, but again, we got to see and have some conversations about some things. Um, you know, we learn more about Demi's experience, the shift that changed her eating disorder, um, then introduction of substances, how she interacted with people when they came on set. Um, how she really wasn't herself. And it took her a while to get to the person that she is today. Um, Keenan, again, he came and he, he talked a little bit. Um, we learned that he, there was a situation where, you know, he was on top of the world. It was the best time of his career. And they found out that someone who had been managing the finances had stolen a lot of money from them. We find out something similar with Allison, but that's kind of his deep, um, as it went, also the idea that their value, perceived value, their own perception of value stemmed around applause and followers and likes and who showed up. You know what I mean? Which is sad, but just really indicative of the spaces that they were in. We meet Allison and you remember Allison because she like had danced in the Missy Elliott video. That's where I remember her from. Um, but she and Demi did a lot of the Disney projects together um, and we find out that they started out being closed. They both actually had a eat, suffered from an eating disorder um, and that they were friends for a while. And then Demi started to change and that friendship kind of veered off. But we find out that Allison had money stolen as well. Um, Raven, you know, knowing that she was really a commodity from a, a young age that, you know, no, this is a job. My parents told me that, that this is what feeds the family. Um, and this idea that kids are the breadwinners would have been something that I would have have loved to explore on a deeper level. Um, we know a lot of Drew Barrymore's story because she's been candid and open. Um, but even in that, we didn't really go too deep. Um, and if I had any criticism for it, that would be it. I think, like I said, the expectation is that we're going to go beneath the surface and we're going to get to the root of things. Um, but sometimes I think when we tell our own stories, right, um, it can be hard to talk about the things that may not show us um, in the best light. But you guys drop it in the comments. Let me know if you watched. Let me know what your thoughts were. Did, did you love this? Did you feel like you learned something new? Um, I unfortunately had felt like I had seen and heard a lot of it um, before. But you guys let me know in the comments. And yeah, if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all of the things, okay? And I will see y'all in the next video. Thanks.